Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can transfer data from the internal storage to the micro SD card at the Samsung Galaxy A14 5G. Yeah, for that we will have already a pre-installed file explorer so you don't need to download an extra app or something like this. We have already everything here. Okay, just uh, go now to the app drawer here and you will find the Samsung folder. Huh? And apart from the Samsung folder, I see the app named My Files. Okay. At this app, you will have a nice overview, by the way, here with all your images, videos, audio files, and so on. But we will need this point here, the internal storage. And now we see all the folders here at the internal storage, so most of them. Yeah? And uh, I recommend to you, if you want to transfer something, to start at first with the pictures and videos you have done with your camera. Yeah? And you will find them here at the DCIM folder, then at the camera folder. And here are all your pictures you have done and also features and videos you have done with your camera here at this phone. Okay, if you want to transfer something, now choose now the file you want to have and long press it. And now it is marked. No? And now you can mark also some other files you want to transfer. In the case, if you want to transfer all, but I guess, then just tap your on all. And all pictures and videos are selected. After, you have now the chance to go on move or copy. No, copy is just for the safety if you want to keep it here and make just a uh, copy for the safety on your SD card. But I would recommend to you to go on move no, that we have more space here on the internal storage. So go on move. Okay, and now let's go back here to the main overview. And if you're here back in the main overview, then just go here to the SD card. Okay, my SD card have already here some folders. Now I would really recommend to you to create here some folders because then you don't lose the overview because if you mix up your PDF files with your pictures and so on, then you um, then you lose the, the control and the overview and that's not good. So if you don't have any folders here, just go here on the three points and here you can create some folders. No? So I've created already here a DCM folder and uh, yeah, if you're on the folder, you want to have the pictures and videos in, just go here on move here and the phone will transfer all the pictures now to the SD card. Right? Let me show you something else. Let us go back here. By the way, you can go also on the uh, folder house here, no? on the house, also on the folder with the house in it. So. <laughs> and uh, let's go here again on the internal storage um, because you can um, not only transfer files, you can also transfer complete folders. That's the same thing. So just long press maybe here the DCM folder and the download folder, music folder, and picture folder, and so on. And then you can uh, also move data or copy the folders completely to the SD card. So same thing, pretty nice. Let me show you something else, because if you have inserted the SD card right now, you can also manage it that uh, all your future pictures and videos are going directly to the SD card. That saves a lot of time because you don't have to do this procedure, what I've shown you here in that video. Huh? So for that, just go to the camera app, as I've done here. Just tap you on the setting symbol. And now scroll down a bit and you will have this point here now, storage location. And here you can set it up if you want to have internal storage for your future pictures and videos, or if you want to have the SD card. So choose the SD card. And that means whenever you shoot a picture or a video right now, it will go directly to your SD card. I hope I could help you with this video and answer your question. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me something that would be very helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for, and I've created also some other videos if you're interested in, with some more tips and tricks and so on. You can also subscribe me to don't miss a new video. Thank you so, so much for all your support and yeah, maybe the next time. <laughs> Ciao.